Yo, what's up guys, Sunin here and today before we get into the tutorial I just want to say a few things First thing, yes, I know I've been absent for a long time and it's mainly because I didn't have a lot of time and motivation to edit and do tutorials and stream but that doesn't matter right now because I'm back um, me and few guys uh, they're helping me um, really upload more because I don't really have time to upload every day or every other day like I used to do because mainly school started I have work to do um, the second thing I wanted to say is I started streaming and it seems like YouTube um, turned off the notifications for my channel I guess so the first time I started streaming after the break my stream crashed and after the end there was like 60 people in first few seconds and after that there were like five six people when I started the stream the second time so something happened and I don't really I can't really find a solution for that but I'll try but in meantime um, it would mean a lot to me if you guys could um, turn on the notifications so you get notified when I stream or check the YouTube around 8 p.m. Um, my time uh, my time is GMT plus 2 so Central Europe London plus 2 I guess I'm living in Serbia so if I'm wrong you can search up time in Serbia around 8 p.m. and the third thing I wanted to say is about this tutorial so um, I will be making a series about motion graphics so this is a MoGraph tutorial if I'm not wrong um, this was heavily requested in my DMs on channel everywhere and um, not really like just for the tutorial people are asking me like how did you do this can you help me um, and that's why I'm making this I'll be making like few episodes like okay first one is the one that you saw in the preview um, like that circle the second one will be some other um, type of MoGraph uh, and the third one also and then when I cover up some of them I'll be making a watch me edit um, series which when where I will be making a full MoGraph edit and posting that so it'll be like few episodes of tutorials few episodes of watch me edit and then you I'll, I'll be covering up like a lot of not everything obviously um, not most of the things because there are so many opportunities and I'm not, not really the best but it's like okay for beginners and like I don't know maybe kind of medium I don't know <laughs> whatever so yeah um, if this video doesn't get 500 likes I will not make part 2 because I know a lot of you that just watch the tutorial and don't like don't subscribe um, I get a lot of more um, like 90% of you are not even subscribed and I'll, I know a lot of you come watch the tutorial go and then come again and watch the tutorial so why is it so hard to subscribe and like it's it's like two seconds and it really means a lot and it motivates me to continue um, so yeah please like this video right now um, and I will make I'll part two part three whatever um, I hope this is gonna go well and this is a simple tutorial for for beginners but really to get you into this uh, motion graphics so yeah um, without stalling any longer let's just get into this tutorial all right so we're inside of after effects and this is pretty much how it looks um, like right off the without putting it anywhere um, you can do it in a few ways and you don't need any plugins it's pretty pretty easy and now I'll be showing you okay so all you need to do is to click here and um, really find so press Q until you find the circle when you find the circle hold shift to make it like really nice and like good shaped then align it to the center and pre-compose it when you do that you're gonna press S for scaling and then make this scale like me okay so like to here and then make it like really big 
I'm gonna come here and do the graph like I like I do so like that and I have this so I'll show you a few ways to do it so the second way you can do it is to press Ctrl plus D alright so when you duplicate it um, copy paste it Ctrl plus D however you want duplicate it there is few ways you can do it so the first one is really um, put the difference and then go into this graph and just lower it so it's gonna look like that um, if you don't want to use difference you can use um, alpha inverted mate so it's gonna give you the same looks and the second way you can do it is by okay I'm just gonna delete this and so you're gonna duplicate it and you're gonna move it few frames press S to get the and just place it in the same frame as this one so it's gonna give you the same effect of course put the put the alpha invert and you see it's gonna <coughs> my bad so it's gonna give you the same effect no matter how you do it it's just on you um, how fast you want it to be or slow or however is easier to you so I get it that maybe the difference um, is the easiest way but still um, to get this all obviously you, you're gonna click toggle swatches and switches and mode so it could be like this for you you can just click this and get it so yeah that's it for this tutorial please like it uh, 500 likes and I swear I'm making a second part and it's gonna be lit it's gonna be really helpful it's, it's gonna be I'm gonna make a full edit with this style um, with shakes and everything not just this um, subscribe because a lot of you are not subscribed that are watching so please subscribe to support us to motivate me um, if you wanna watch the streams turn on the notification if you maybe know the solution of how to get everyone um, how to get the notifications back um, please write in the comments or DM me at King Sanin or Tsukiyomi Gang. Thanks for watching guys and goodbye.